Hello everyone. Welcome to itblexpert.com. Today we are going to see project about a framework to make voting disk system transparent using blockchain technology. We are going to see a project about online voting using blockchain. This is the project we are going to discuss today. Okay. Before we are studying project, if you need any project help on machine learning deep learning, please follow itblexpert.com. Okay. We are providing best project at feasible cost. Okay. Please follow our website. So that we are going to our project. This project <coughs> uh, reasonably suitable for current technology. Okay. Nowadays everyone using Bitcoin blockchain technology. Okay. So we are tolerating. We are adopting this technology too far uh, for voting. Okay. Online voting. Nowadays everyone doubting on voting. Okay. Whether we are casting vote which is going directly to the party or not. Okay. Why? Because everyone having doubt on that uh, e-pallet machine. Okay, voting pallet machine. That's why we are considering online voting technology. This online voting technology enables everyone to cast their vote from where they are. Okay, everyone to cast their vote from where they are. They can cast their vote from anywhere in the world. Okay, this is the main advantage of this project. But there is the main threat was security. Whether they can track, uh, they can trace our old uh, ID. Okay, we may doubt. Okay, whether they can trace our ID, whether they can uh, trace our uh, party details, everything. Okay, this is the main security problem of the project. So for the security thread, we are giving solution as a blockchain. Okay, blockchain means you may know, you may not know. Okay, blockchain means that completely under security. Okay, the things which you are sharing, it not encrypted. Okay, it will not encrypted. Rather than encryption. It use hash technology. What is the hash technology means? It will convert those data, your personal data, your voting data, and your uh, login data, credential, and everything. It will convert that credential and the, those data into hash format. Hash format means zero, one, something. That hash format. It will convert those data into hash format. Those hash data only will save on the database. Okay. So no one can be decrypt those hash data. Okay, no one can be uh, decrypt this hash data. This is the main advantage here. Okay, only you know. Okay, about your personal detail and the party which you have casted your vote. Okay, that is the main advantage of this project. Okay, this is the IWP pay for this project. Okay, this is the IWP project for this project. Okay, so voter can cast their vote from anywhere. Okay, instead of the polling station and that, this is the existing system, traditional one. And if you are going by the proposal things means this is the app which are going to design okay the voter cast can cast their vote from anywhere okay so this is a smart contract smart contract means it will form the contract okay between you and the admin okay it will verify your identification after verifying your identification directly you can cast that vote your voting and your personal details and everything will directly connect to that app okay those data your personal data and the voting data okay instead of saving directly on the database it will convert those data into smart contract that means hash data those hash data only will save on the database okay then the authorities will don't uh, will not know about your personal details and the voting details and everything but they can see how much vote casted what are the party going to win and everything they can directly trace okay this is the blockchain important blockchain they have created here what are the personal data it will transfer means records, digital values, user profile, candidate profile. It, those are the data will convert into smart candidate. That means blockchain. Okay. This is the project we are going to see. This is the PPD of the project. This is the PPD of the project. We have created PPD for this project also. Secure online voting system using blockchain. Here we are providing abstract. What is online voting? What is the key benefit? Security issue. This is the security issue I am saying. Okay. Authentication issue will come. Our transport voting transport and storage issue will come then network attacks okay maybe someone will cast your vote by using hacking your profile okay these are the security issues DOS attack and MITM attacks man-made middle attacks these are the attacks major threat in the online voting system so we are overcoming this system in existing system everyone using RSA encryption instead of the RSA encryption <coughs> less security Instead of this RS encryption, we are going to use blockchain as a proposal system. This is the major advantage here. Okay. The things which you are sharing now, those things converted into hash, those hash only save in the database. Okay. 
we are using SHA-512 as a proposed hash algorithm here, okay? This is the stage for the project. Okay, we are going to use Anaconda ID and SQL, language Python and HTML we are going to use. This is the project PPT here. Uh, without wasting time, directly I am going to run the project. So, this is the project code here. We have created some uh, Python file for everything here, okay? Directly I am going to run the project. For that, I am using Anaconda ID, okay? Directly I am pasting the project path here. Then I am running the main file. Python space manage.py space run server. This is the project main file I am running here. So once it's run means it will create the localhost address. Directly I am pasting the localhost address here. So this is the project home page. Uh, directly I am running for the admin page here. That you can go for the admin here also, not an issue. This is the admin. I'm using my admin ID as admin1. My password will be 123. You can change your password also, not an issue. So this is the admin. Okay, that election commission now their page. Here they can create political parties. Okay. Directly they can add any political party's name, logos, candidates name, candidate profile, and everything they can add. Okay. For example, just I'm adding uh for example, uh, I am adding DMK. For this, I am just having DMK logo here. DMK logo I have saved. So, party ID will be 125. Party name DMK. Party logo. Party logo I am uh, by candidate name Stalin. Candidate profile picture uh, D DMK dot JPG DMK dot JPG. I have saved here. So the party has been added. Nota, CPI, Congress, BJP, then on top by DMK. Okay. DMK. Okay. Everything has been added here. Okay, everything you added here. You can add any party here. Okay. So once you have added political parties, means what you have to go, what you have to do means you have to add voters also. Okay. The other details now. You have to provide the other details and you have to add the parties. Oh, sorry, voters here. Just I'm adding some voters here. Example, I am considering my other number as a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. This is my other number. Okay, sample I'm considering 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, my name is Madan. I'm giving here. Uh, I'm not giving that uh, person now, that election commission they are creating here. Just I'm giving my data birth here. My pin code will be 605005. Just I'm giving 600044. I'm giving my things. Then I'm giving Tamil Nadu as my region. I don't, uh, here I can give my mail ID also. Expert I typically add gmail.com just i'm saving here just a minute uh, database i have to choose perfect database okay database i have chosen everything okay here my other number added you can add how much uh, any number of voters here okay once voter added political parties added everything added means directly you can go for the directly you can go for the user page okay user page means this is the user page okay user can cast their vote here okay for example i'm giving i want to go to voting means i have to enter my other number one two three four five six seven eight nine this is my other number just i have to authenticate once i'm clicking authenticated means it asking for this is your detail other number your name mother your date of birth your pin code okay everything you have to verify then they will send send me the private number to my mail id okay this mail id given by the election commission of india okay so i have to use my mail id here send otp they are verifying whether me only casting the vote or someone will cast the vote okay they are just verifying okay see otp associated to your mail id just i am using my mail id here okay once i open the mail id means some otp received by election commission of india just I am using my vote. Just I am using this OTP to cast my vote. Okay. 
Okay, I'm entering this OTP and verify. See, email verified. You can cast the vote now. Now I can cast the vote. Okay. Just voting button I'm clicking means. <coughs> See, it will show the political parties and everything. Everything it will show. Example, I'm choosing Communist Party as my vote. Okay. Just I'm clicking vote now. I'm selecting Communist Party of India to vote. Input your private key. Some blockchain key will be sent to my mail ID. I have to verify again whether me only or not. See, private key has been received. Just I have to copy this private key. You can give your mail ID also, not an issue. Just for sample, I am giving my mail. Okay, see, I have to verify again. Actually, for voting, I just pasted this here. Just I am casting vote. See, your vote has been signed successfully. Your ballot has. This is the hash key I am talking about. It will contains. It contains my name and party details and everything. Generator signature. These are the blockchain things. The details, my personal details, my voting details, everything has been converted into blockchain. That app, it will show my blockchain details. Okay. I can happily leave this website. Okay. Without worrying about my privacy. Okay. This is the private things. Okay. Directly you can cast any number of votes here. Okay. Just I'm refreshing. Okay. Once refreshing or exit means next person have to vote. Okay. By this way, anyone can cast their vote. Okay, you want to cast, you want to count the voting means the admin know the secret things. Show the vote count. See the things here. BJ uh, Bhagujan Samajwadi Party four votes, Communist Party of India three votes, Nota two votes, BJP two, Indian National Congress one, DMK zero zero. These are the votes casting casted votes. Okay, I already casted many votes here. Okay, while testing. So this is the vote count. Admin can directly verify. Admin can check the mining also, blockchain mining, here things. Now I captured one note vote now. For example, this is the mining transaction. One transaction has been sealed. If you want to open that seal means start mining. See the hash here. Previous hash, Merkle hash, block hash. Okay, this is the hash. Okay, will save on the database. Directly, you don't know about the person who casted the vote. Which party you don't know? Okay, everything will be on secret things. Okay, then overall blockchain things. This is the complete vote. Twelve votes, twelve votes had been casted. Okay, twelve votes overall. Those as TDS. Okay, overall twelve votes. Okay. If you want to check the things, means I have to go for the twenty-two eight. See the things. Twenty-eight two thousand twenty-two. 28 2022 two votes i have in, i have casted okay those black thing everything you can check okay you can verify the things also okay you can verify also those blocks by admin you can verify also like this way you can cast all your votes here. okay this is completely a blockchain part completely blockchain things okay from here also you can go for the admin things okay everything Okay, so if you want this project, if you want to purchase this project, means please call ITBLEXPERT.com. Here many projects available on Python, okay, machine learning and deep learning. Okay, many projects available. Directly you can purchase from here also. Thank you.